So as some of you are already aware, uh, I recently started stocking the chestnut buffing tree and uh, accessory packs. So I just wanted to go through the differences between this and the Beal system, which I've been using for about three years now. So here we are. The Beal system has eight inch wheels, whereas the chestnut has six inch. So, get that set up here. So how this works is, make sure you wear a face shield first. Get your speed up to 1600, 1700. You can preload the wheel, the red compound, white compound, and car now the wax. So if you're doing a lot of small items, great way to get a shine on them is by using one of these type systems. So this is a PCU I did a few years back. Oh, that was sitting in a museum for a while. You can see the deep glass shine on that. And this is one with an ordinary finish that wasn't uh, polished up. So this system is smaller and this is the smallest lathe I have in shop. So you can see it fits perfectly. So basically you have your chuck and this is the large mandrel that fits inside the chuck like that. The buffing tree is then connected. It's, uh, it's threaded in this way and it's held by the tailstock. So when you set it up you don't do it too tight or it'll damage the tree. So you can buy the buffing tree and the accessory pack oh. and that should have should have the small mandrel in there as well so here you have the, the red, white and carnal wax compound so if you're starting off you buy this and the buffing tree and you're ready to go now the large mandrels which are can be sold separately also work with the the dome buffs which are great for small pieces or small bowls and I have them in three different sizes. Have a look at my website davidcondonwoodcraft.ie